What's the longest hostile game in chess? Well, being 269 moves and lasting 20 hours, the longest official chess game was when Nokovic played Arsevic in 1989. But that doesn't even come close to the longest theoretical chess game. For the game not to end, every 50 moves, a move being both white and black moving, you must capture a piece or move upon. You must not repeat the same position three times during the game, and there has to be sufficient material to win. Using this, you could find the expression, since you have to move a piece or capture upon every 50 moves, you multiply it by the amount of pieces able to be captured added to the total number of possible pawn moves. However, you must waste eight captures so the pawns don't stop each other from getting to the end of the board. This is shown by subtracting eight times fifth. The last problem emerges when white or black has to capture or move a pawn on the first half of the 50th move. This occurs four times and that's why we subtract two, making the longest possible game a whopping 5,898 moves.